What is a vendor credit in QuickBooks Online? A vendor credit is when instead of getting a cash refund, a vendor gives a financial adjustment or credit to a client to fix problems with a product or service they provided. This credit can be part or all of the amount that the vendor owes the client. The client can then use this credit for future purchases or to pay future invoices. Vendor credits typically result from overbilling, returned goods, or unsatisfactory services. However, they can also apply in other situations depending on the agreement between the vendor and the client. Now, if you have vendor credits entered in QuickBooks Online, you can see them a few different ways. This first way, if you know which vendor that you have credit with, then you can hover over expenses on the left menu bar and then click on vendors. And then you can either search for that vendor here with the search bar, or you can scroll down and find the vendor that way. So we're gonna scroll down here. And as you can see here, Cal Telephone has a negative balance here of $20. So if we click on this vendor here to open it up, we'll see that we don't have any open bills with this vendor and we have a vendor credit here of $20 that we can apply to a future bill. Now, if we go back to vendors, we know that we also have a vendor credit with Norton Lumber and Building Materials. So if we scroll down here to find that vendor, we'll see that this vendor still has an amount showing owed here on this screen. So if we click on this vendor to open it up, we'll see that we have an unpaid bill of $205 and we have a vendor credit here of $50. So our amount showing open for this vendor is $155. Now the next way that you can see vendor credits is to go up here to the top left corner and click on the plus new and choose pay bills. This shows here bills that you have entered in QuickBooks. And over here, you'll see the column that says credit applied. Most of these show not available, but as you can see, the vendor that we just had open, Norton Lumber and Building Materials, has a field here. So if we click on this field, you can see that underneath here, it now shows the amount that is available to apply to this vendor's bill. And the third way that we're gonna cover is if you want to see all of your vendor credits in one place, we can again go up here to the top left corner and click on the plus new, and then this time we're gonna click on vendor credit. And then we're gonna click on the top left here, and this will show you the most recent ones that you've created. And then we're gonna click on view more. In the transaction type drop down here, we're gonna choose bill credit. And now this shows us our vendor credits in one place. If you're tired of searching on YouTube for how to use QuickBooks just to get your bookkeeping done for your business, we can help. How would it feel to have all of that time back that you spend on keeping up the books for your business? Have that time back to spend on the money-making activities of your business or even use that time to go on a vacation or spend it with family. If this is something that sounds inviting to you, my name is Melinda and I'm a QuickBooks Online Certified Pro Advisor and owner of 406 Bookkeeping Services. Check out the link in the description of this video and let's see if our services are the right fit for your business. Now, if you wanna see how to enter a vendor credit in QuickBooks Online, then check out this next video and I'll show you how to do exactly that.